Hello and welcome back to the 2021 ukulele challenge. Please let me know what ukulele you are playing for this challenge in the comments down below. By the way, I am loving seeing your posts on social media. It is so exciting to see and hear you play. Please continue using the hashtag and tagging me so that I can see your progress throughout this journey. All right, so next I'm gonna do a demo of the song and then I'll come back around and teach it line by line. This song feels long, but line one, line two, and line four are exactly the same. So technically, we only have two lines to learn. So let's just go straight into it. Okay, so go to an F chord position. Please pick on the two middle strings. Remember not to pluck. I don't want to pull out. It's more of closing the hand together. <laughs> so we've got that for the first note, and then just E string. Then go to third fret. And here's something a little bit more tricky. We're gonna pick on C and A strings. And then C and E. Try not to move the chord hand around too much because you really want the, the strings to ring as long as possible. And if you let go and move the fingers around or even relax the hand and touch another string next to what you're holding, you'll mute the string, you'll kill the note. So really start thinking about how long your strings sing, okay? So that first bar sounds like this, one, two, three, four. Next one, one, two, three, four. Let's do it together, one, two, ready, go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, again, again. One, two, you got this. Go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Now for the next position, I have my middle finger on the second fret of C and my index finger on the first fret of E. And I'm gonna pick just those two strings. Then open A string. Then I'm gonna put my ring finger on the third fret of E string. And have an open C string and pick those two strings. Then just E string. And do you remember your first note was like a F chord, but just the two middle strings? You're gonna pick that again. So let me uh, play just these two bars right here from the B flat. One, two, three, four, one. That's kind of a fun position to move around to again. Ready, go. One, two, three, four, one, two, again, go. One, two, Last time, go. One, two, three, four, one. Okay, so let's play through all of line one, which is line two and line four as well. So 75% of the song, let's try it. Here we go. One, two, you can do it, go. Alrighty, 
right now let's learn line three and then we'll have the song in the bag so the chord shape on top tells me g minor even though i'm not going to use the index finger i'm going to do kind of like a little fake g minor and then i'm going to pick the two middle strings then just e string then just c string two three four then both together and then that index finger that I would have used on A string to make that G minor shape, I'm gonna use on E string. Then open, two, you're already there, and then open. So that line will go like this, one, two, ready, and one, two, three, four, one, two. Learn from my mistake. I got a little bit impatient and I wanted to pick, like have the thumb ready to pick the next note and I muted my string instead of letting it sing. So learn from my mistake. Make sure that you let your notes ring out. Let's do line three again. One, two, ready, go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, Two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Now you have everything you need to learn how to play this song, Patreon fam, or if you would like to join the Patreon fam, you get a play along video and it's looped so that you can just practice playing through the song alongside me. For your homework today, I would like for you to focus a lot on letting the notes ring out. So if your notes are dying like this, it may be that your fingers are touching the strings too quickly. So pick and let go. And let those notes be long. We use the word legato in music. Make sure that they're long, long and attached, right? So you don't want this. You don't want that. You want them to be like almost touching. Ta, ta, ta. So please listen to your ukulele if you hear this. Um, focus on letting the string ring and go slower. Two, three. That will make your chord melody arrangements sound like you've been playing for a really long time. By the way, throughout this video, I've been playing my Enya Nova ukulele. This actually comes in other colors. It comes in red and pink. Some have like designs on them like cherry blossoms. So I will link it down below. This is a waterproof ukulele that comes with pre-installed strap buttons, a really cool fitted strap. I haven't seen other ukuleles with strap, not strapped, um, gig bags, like the one that it comes with. It also comes with a strap that matches the color of the design that you end up choosing. So this one came with an all black, like super sleek strap. All right, fam. Well, we're going to check out. Please continue posting your covers in Euglandia, our Facebook group, and on Instagram using the hashtag 2021 Uke Challenge or 30 Day Uke Challenge or Euglandia. We have a bunch of hashtags. So I'll be looking for you. Tag me. I'm Plazi, and I'll see you in the next one. Ciao!